So how much muscle do you need for badminton? Do you need a big round muscle like a bodybuilder? Probably not because the big muscle will only give you power but that power doesn't trans transfer over to your racket head. So what we need for badminton is a long lasting muscle, a muscle that can give you speed and give you endurance. With this, I'm going to demonstrate a few of the uh, weights training. This is only part of the weights training that we, we can sh we'll show you. It's not the whole training, weight training that we have for badminton. And the simple way is uh, I'm going to use a bar, which David is going to pass it on to me. Thank you, David. Oh, this is heavy. Actually, this is just an 18 pound weight, which is cushioned and you can buy it at any other sports authority or Dick's Sporting Goods shop. The first one I'm going to do is for my overhead position, for my racket speed on when anything that's above my shoulder. What I do is I have my bar going backwards with my wrist bent back and my elbow close up this way. I try not to open up my, my elbow this way. So close my elbow, finger control, my wrist pull forward. This is what I'll do for the racket speed. The faster I go with the wrist, the finger, the better it is. Try not to open up this way and try not to go too much down, just forward, up and forward. So what's the repetition? How many times do we do? We probably do 200 times. If you can finish one shot in 200, that's the best. If you cannot, you can break it down to whichever you can finish the maximum and then you make sure you do it with a partner so the partner can count for you and the partner can take over when you take a break and then it's your turn to count for your partner. 